Clayton, how's your health and everything? How's it, how's your spring going? Uh, my health's pretty good, actually. Um, I haven't been practicing. I was practicing uh, the beginning of spring ball, kind of getting back into things. Um, I'm kind of dealing with some minor stuff right now. I'm not even really related, um, so I'll be back here next next week or the next couple of days. So, uh, overall, really excited about you know, how, how I've come, come along and uh, regarding my, my health status and stuff like that. So, I'm really excited to get back into that. Yeah, I was just excited yeah. to do some football, right? Yeah, for sure. It feels like it's been a long time coming. You know, I don't I don't think I've been more hungry to you know, get back and to play with my guys and you know, just get back to doing what, what, what I love best. Um, how frustrating has this entire experience been? Just not being able to stay healthy and get out on the field. I'm not gonna lie, it's been probably one of the, the hardest tests of my life. I know God, you know, He has a plan for me. Um, I'm I'm trying my best, you know, to stick to that plan. Um, but I mean, I can I can kind of find some good out of it. You know, I've been I've never been more motivated than I am, more hungry to get back. Like I just said, um, and you know, I think I think you know. This, this will really help me um, kind of get a new perspective for things, appreciate what I have for what it is a little bit better. And I think once I fully get back, um, you know, I'm just going to be a different person overall. You also just sick of that an answering the question. I yeah, I mean, nah, nah, I mean, I get it. You know, um, I was out last season, so obviously there's going to be some questions about it. Um, you know, nothing you know, it doesn't strike me too much. Um, I just know I'm excited to get back, get, get back with my guys, get back to doing what I love. So. Just watching the tight end group, it seems like that entire room's transformed a little bit. Is it kind of fun knowing that there are opportunities there to get out onto the field? Oh, for sure. I mean, we got a good group of guys, you know, with um, some guys coming in like Bauer, Devon. Um, we got Jake, too. Um, so we definitely got a, a good group of guys coming in, and we all got a good chemistry already. Um, you know, I, we. You know, talk obviously every day, but you know, outside of football, we got each other's back, stuff like that. So I mean, I would say I'm really excited to see you know how this group is going to perform, um, you know, how we're going to attack the season for sure. You mentioned what stood out to you so far about Devon. Uh, Devon, obviously size. You know, he's a freshman. He looks like you know, fifth year senior already. So I mean, Devon, really excited to see what you know he's capable of. I and mean, we're already uh, kind of starting to see some of that stuff. So it's good to just like I said, be out there with the guys. Um, and having fun at that. So, you got a great podcast that's going on now. Everybody's talking about it. So, how did that come together? And it's still going pretty well. Yeah. So, um, actually, the coach who recruited me at Arizona State, he got out of coaching um, and kind of got into the podcast business stuff like that. So he hit me up uh, a few years ago, asked me if I wanted to do a pod, um, if I wanted to be the co-host, and that's where uh, kind of Nick came in the situation. So. We're definitely blessed, blessed for it, and you know it's been nothing but nothing but good for us. So. How much has Coach Finley just kind of helped you develop since you've been here the last couple of years? Oh, I mean, amazingly. I mean, before I before I got here, you know, you kind of think you know you know stuff, but once you really get to college, you understand that you know you don't know as much as you do. And Finley's done a really good job of helping me kind of just slow things down. And um, I know Bauer said this in an interview. He's, he helps us really like kind of dumb things down and makes the game just easier for us to understand, basically. Um, you know, that's my guy. You know, he hits me up every week about my health, how, how I'm doing mentally, stuff like that. So I appreciate him for that. From the outside looking in, it would seem with him now being a co-office coordinator, Seth, I'm sure loves the fullback, haven't played it. Do you guys see yourself, is it, is it different now for you guys, just your role just in terms of a tight end with the new offense? Oh, yeah, I would say for sure. I mean, it definitely helps having your you know, position coach and offensive coordinator, two guys who play the fullback tight end position. Um, I think I think it will be a lot, bring a lot of um, diversity to the offense, and we'll definitely see more more tight end involvement this year. Um, and we definitely got the guys to do it, so I'm excited. Caden, what have you seen from Devon Mitchell so far in these first couple practices? Yeah, Devon, you know, he's, like I said, he looks like a fifth-year senior. He's a true freshman. Um, you know, he's been doing really good. He's uh, still trying to pick up on stuff mentally, but, you know, that's expected with, you know, the freshman guys. Um, but I would say he's doing a doing a really good job so far. I'm proud of him. With Bauer Sharp being a former quarterback and, and coming into this room and uh, bringing some more athleticism to the room, what have you seen from him? Uh, and, and what does he bring to the room as far as leadership goes? Oh, yeah, Bauer, I mean, that's my guy. Um, you know, like, like you say, he did play quarterback, so, I mean, that brings a lot of diversity to the room as well, and he kind of sees the game in a different light as well, which, um, you know, we can all help each other. We, we can help him um, 
seeing it from a tight end's perspective, he can help us seeing it from a, a read and quarterback perspective. So we kind of piggyback off of each other, and that's something I like about it. And then, you know, he is an athletic guy, um, strong, physical, and, you know, he brings the best out of all of us, and we try to do the same for him. So. Thanks, man. Yeah. Thank you.